Hello friends, I'm Alana and welcome to my channel. If you've been following me for a while, or you knew me from IGN, or my games media days before that, then you probably know that I'm an enormous fan of the Gears of War franchise. Uh, I, I really love Gears. And I had the absolute pleasure of recording some voice lines for Gears 5. So I am in this game, I'm in the credits, I am officially in one of the games in this franchise, and that is crazy cool. And so I finally got to a point in Gears 5 where I think that two of my characters are sitting around somewhere, so I wanted to capture the moments of me finding them for the first time. People have sent me clips and photos of them finding it, but uh, I've been late to playing this game because damn, there are a lot of video games out right now. So I have heard it, but I haven't really experienced it for myself. I've actually been pretty chill about this whole thing, and now that I booted it up and I'm actually doing it, and I know that one of my characters is nearby, it's a whole other thing. This is this is crazy. I've been playing Gears for a decade. If I could tell 13-year-old Alana who wanted an Xbox 360 because one of her friends played Gears of War and she was obsessed with it, that at some point in the future I would be in one of these games. Okay, let me just start looking, because there's no reason I can't talk and look at the same time. I actually have no idea whereabouts specifically I am in this area. Uh, I just know that I'm in this camp somewhere. Hey, wow, it's the cog. Welcome. Now get the hell out. I think one of my characters is that rude for the record. On, Damn, this game's pretty. It's got worms. So a lot of people ask me how this happened and um, what games I've been voice acting for, etc., etc. Um, I am in or I've recorded for three games so far. I'm also in a game called Off the Party. Where you going, dog? Where you going? All right, bye. Uh, After Party's coming out late this year, and I am more significant characters in After Party, whereas in this game, I'm uh, really just NPCs who help populate this town. Whereas in After Party, I'm more of a quest giver. Um, the third game, I'm not allowed to tell you about yet. So it's obviously something, something I'm very new to that I would like to learn how to get better at, that I'm by no means an expert at. So for all the people who've been like, oh, Alana, it'd be really cool if you would make a like how to voice act video. I'm totally not at a place where I can do that just yet. I have a small amount of experience with studios that have been very patient with me and very helpful with me. Um, and I think I recorded for maybe like seven characters in Gears 5. Uh, I, I know of three that made it, and one of them only like a couple of people have picked up on because I am doing a voice, like a different accent. It's not just me speaking. So that one's a lot less obvious. But Gears came about literally because Rod Ferguson asked me uh, about a year and a half ago. He asked if I was willing to be a part of the game. And uh, naturally, as an enormous Gears of War fan, I said yes. <laughs> and it's something that I've had a lot of fun doing. I really, really like doing it. Um, I don't think that I would be interested in voice acting for anything other than video games, because video games are my passion, of course. I don't know that it's something I'd want to try to branch into doing for cartoons or whatever else. <gasps> DBs are the reason my old man left the cog back in the day. Didn't trust him. That's me. It's poetic justice in a way. Live by the AI, die by the AI. Yeah, well, we'll see how poetic or just you find it when a bunch of beach DBs start marching through town. <laughs> Their problems are our problems. What? You want to join them? I don't like that line. No. Don't like that one. I've seen stranger bedfellows in a tough fight. What if it's all psyops tricks? Ever think of that, huh? Some plan to get us back on the bad side? So this is the one where I was like a conspiracy I theorist? That. Wouldn't put anything past the cog. Well, hang on. You're suggesting <laughs> that the cog wants its entire army turned against it just to convince us to rejoin the coalition? That's your informed view? Yeah, that is, with certain adjustments, mind you. That's my informed view. What? You don't think it's possible? Uh, no, I don't. Why not? Look, conspiracies are about controlling the outcome. Losing your army on purpose isn't a great way to maintain control. Maybe the cog is controlling you right now. <laughs> controlling me. Controlling it's so all weird. Of this. It's so weird. Oh, man. <sighs> So, that one specifically, um, with everything that I recorded for Gears of War, they make you record three versions of every line. So three versions of every sentence, so you do them all differently and then they get to pick which one they like the most. That one specifically, I didn't have a character to respond to, so the people on the other side of the booth, 
the directors were reading my lines, uh, or sorry, reading the other characters' lines, so I was responding to them in a conversational way rather than responding to the actor, but sometimes they actually cue the actor in. Um, so they play them through your headphones and then you respond to them like a conversation, which is actually really cool. I liked doing it that way. Uh, very weird. Um, obviously doesn't look like me. <laughs> and she didn't seem to be moving at all. That's... I... Yeah, very cool, okay. I know there's another one around here somewhere. Uh, I forgot what I was saying before I rudely interrupted myself. Okay, try as I might, just went through a big old combat section, cleared this place the hell out. Uh, I could only find one of them. I think the other one I must have missed because I feel like it happens from what I've seen, from what people have showed me before there's combat. It seems like the village is still peaceful. Or well, maybe it happens later in the game when you go back to that point. You I'm not sure. Help that convoy or what? All right, Oscar. Okay, give me a second. All right, I'm talking to the people on the internet. All right. Uh, and then the other one, I think I'm in a comms tower. Um, but this was very cool. It's a very cool thing to be able to do. A genuine honor to have been able to do it, um, even if I am just some minor background NPCs. And again, I just keep thinking that 13 year old Alana. I don't think I'd believe it if you told me that at the time, that I would be in a Gears of War game when that is a franchise that I have just loved so much my whole life, pretty much. <laughs> at least half of it. I actually had a girl I went to high school with uh, message me and congratulate me on being in the game because she came on, over one night just after Gears there. 2 came out. Her boyfriend had broken up with her, so I was talking to this girl about her breakup while playing through that entire campaign, and I remember that so vividly. Uh, just a lot of really awesome experiences out of this I franchise. Kind and of in a hurry. Now I'm in it, and that's very cool. So, yeah. Again, sorry that I can't answer your questions about voice acting more helpfully. Um, if I feel like I'm in a place where I'm confident, and I'm not just like doing cameos and taking every opportunity I can to learn, then I'm sure that I would, but right now, I, I feel like it would be arrogant of me to give any, everyone or anyone advice. I am definitely not there yet. Uh, but I do have plans to continue doing it. Don't have plans to do it full time or anything, but I don't want to stop doing it. Uh, I've had a lot of fun and I really do love video games. It's also just really cool that this is the first game where my name's in the credits. And again, that it's Gears of War is a huge deal. So, Of course, I will announce more voice projects when I can. Um, after Party, I'm really excited about those ones. I did a British accent for one of them. <laughs> Hopefully it's authentic. <laughs> but uh, thank you all for watching. I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.